Today, I received my uh, carbon fiber GVM motorized camera slider. And I thought that what I would do is, as I'm doing the review, rather than just do an unboxing, because everybody that has this thing has basically done an unboxing of it. And, uh, you know, they show you all the features and they show you the, you know, the motor and they show you the settings and all that stuff, which is cool. You know, I think that's important. Uh, but really what you want to see is how it performs. So anyway, I'm actually filming this review with my, uh, my G85 is sitting on top of a ball head that's sitting on top of the, uh, the slider and I've just got it sitting on my bed. So just to show you what, what I'm seeing is this. So as you can see, the slider, I've got it set at, oh geez, let me see what the speed is on the remote controller. I've got it set at 33% and I've got it doing a looping uh, back and forth motion with a little bit of tracking. So if you kind of, you can see how the, uh, the rod is canted in this direction here. All right, but anyway, yeah, that's what I'm seeing from over here. And uh, it does a very, very good job. It's super smooth. I may have bumped into the bed just now when I was uh, taking the shot, but it comes to a nice, smooth stop. Um, I am recording with an external microphone. I'm using the Rode Video Micro. Uh, I'm sorry, the Rode Wireless Go. I'm sorry, I was using the Rode Video Micro earlier today, but using the Rode Wireless Go. So that's on the... Uh, on the cage on the camera. I've got the camera in a small rig full cage for the G85. So it's not, you know, it's not super heavy, but it's not super light and it's doing just fine. Um, I can't hear the slider from here. In fact, I can hear my Godox SL60 light a little bit more than I can hear anything else. Um, but yeah, it's super smooth doing a great job even when it gets to the ends of the, and I don't have it going completely all the way to the end here. I've got it going probably about three quarters of the way. And I just wanted to test out the, uh, you know, the keeping your subject near the center of the frame. But it seems to be working just fine. Um, it'll probably go forever on one of these Sony NPF batteries. Uh, it came shipped perfectly. It was in a gigantic box but the box itself that it came in was super small. Um, the case that it comes in is soft but padded, has a bunch of extra cables or remote cables for different types of cameras. Uh, I'm really liking it. I think, you know, as a short 31 inch setup, you, know, you could throw this thing either on a heavy duty tripod or two uh, short light stands and easily, you know, set it up for interviewing or, Later on, I am going to try to do some like push in and pull out and see how that goes. Um, but I'm sure it's going to be fine. You can adjust the speed on the fly. So let's say I wanted to speed it up right now. I could literally speed it up while I'm shooting. Now I've got it at 76%. So this is going to be a little silly because um, it is going to be moving probably too quickly for an interview style setup. But as you can see, working smoothly. Um, again, this is the shot of the slider itself moving. It's doing a great job. Anyway, real quick review. I uh, really like this thing. It's very, very light. Uh, it came with an extra belt, so I know that when this one wears out, and it looks like a pretty standard belt, you can probably find it just about anywhere. So that's it. That's my review of the GVM 31-inch carbon fiber motorized camera slider. Peace.